plan term, whatever the plan you are creating, this is valid. How long for the employee? There are two options, calendar year and anniversary year. Okay. So when you choose this uh, calendar year, whenever we choose this calendar year, here it comes. Whenever we are attending for an interview, this is very important question in the interviews. What is the options plan type? Uh, generally, we'll be discussing types of plans are this six types. Accrual plan, qualification, no entitlement, and after that, uh, compensation, donation, agreement. Six different types we have. But while defining the options plan, what are the different types of plan terms we have? What are the different types of plan terms we have? There are two types of plan terms. One is calendar year. Another one is anniversary year. Calendar year is nothing but from the so-and-so date. I'm just mentioning January 1st. Of course, you can specify uh, any date. If you mention from this date, it takes one year. It means 1st January 23 to 1st January 24. This options plan will be closed. And again, from 1st January 24th onwards, again, it will be reinitiated to the employee. Yes. It is automatically calculated for employee from 1st January 2024. Okay, but instead of that, if I choose anniversary year, for example, anniversary year is nothing but, for example, if you hire an employee today, today is 22nd June 2023, okay, and you are going to assign the options plan to the employee, then what will happen from today date onwards, next year date, next year in the sense 22nd June 2024, this options plan is going to be the valid means whatever the leaves you are going to allocate that will be the term or duration for an employee so whatever the plan you are creating this options plan it's valid for calendar year or anniversary year calendar year or anniversary year okay so if you say calendar year it's valid from so and so date to so and so date if you say anniversary year if employee join on so and so date from that date to next joining date whatever the one year is there till that time it's going to be valid okay from the higher date onwards so for this particular one what i'm going to specify is it's going to be anniversary year i'm mentioning some clients will take it so whether employee join in any time doesn't matter we are going to specify from the calendar year it means from january to december or whatever the date is required that will be specified okay these are the two different types of plan terms we have options plan terms we have in our options one of the very important question in the interviews